Hello dear students and welcome back to K Gutte's online lecture series. So you are here with myself Dr. K W Gutte, your course educator. In the present video lecture we are going to deal with on the rule of the road. This is an essay written by well-known British essayist A. G. Gardiner. What is the theme of the essay? He talks about personal liberty as well as social liberty. Sometimes personal liberty has to be curtailed for the social order. And he talks about the rules of the road, how to behave in the society, how to follow the responsibilities in the society, whether individual liberty is important or the social liberty is important. So, be with me in this video lecture to know about A.G. Gardiner's The Rule of the Road. The essay on the rule of the road by A. G. Gardiner. The full name of A. G. Gardiner is Alfred George Gardiner. His lifespan is between 1865 to 1946. A. G. Gardiner was an English journalist, editor, and author. His essays written under the allies alpha of the plo are highly regarded. His pen name was alpha of the plo. Sometimes he has written some essays under the pen name alpha of the plo and some essays are also written under the name of initial of A. G. Gardiner. So remember this question can be asked in MCQ. What is the pen name of E.G. Gardiner of the following? The answer will be Alpha of the Plo. The daily life of Englishmen and other common issues is the core of his writing. He has written mainly upon the issues of common British men. Along with common issues, A. G. Gardiner projected socio-political, intellectual, economic and religious issues of contemporary British society. The present essay appeared in A. G. Gardiner's anthology entitled Lives in the Wind. This anthology is also written under his pen name Alpha of the Plo. As we know, On the Rule of the Road is written by British author A. G. Gardiner. On the Rule of the Road tells us to follow law and order. We should behave civilized and should give importance to the social order, for that we should curtail individual liberty. Social order is more important than individual liberty, according to A. G. Gardiner. For that, our individual liberties must be curtailed, must be controlled. Examples are given by A. G. Gardiner. The example of traffic police is given that the role of traffic police is to maintain rules of traffic. Otherwise, everyone who try to keep his liberty as per his wish, then road would be blocked and it will lead to some mishap like accident. So everyone must consider liberty as a social contract. And this personal liberty or individual liberty should be curtailed so that every person in this society can live together with peace and harmony. So what is important according to A.G. Gardiner that social liberty and social order is important to live together with each other 
with peace and harmony because peace and harmony in the society or in social order is more important than individual liberty. Mr. Arthur Ransom told the story to A.J. Gardiner that a stout old lady was walking with her basket down the middle of the street in Petrograd to a great confusion of the traffic and with no small peril to herself. It was pointed out to her that pavement was the place for foot passengers. But she replied, what she replied? She replied, I am going to walk where I like because we have got liberty. So this was her, her answer when somebody told her that this is not the way to walk in between the road for the walkers, for the foot passengers, there is a pavement. You can go and walk on that pavement because we, we the cab drivers or the car drivers or the vehicle drivers are not able to drive if the people are walking in the middle of the road. She said that I am going to walk where I like because we have got liberty, but this is not the way to give the answer to somebody who is giving you the right direction to walk. Gardiner says that if liberty entitled to foot passengers to walk down in the middle of the road, it's also entitled to the cab driver to drive on the pavement. If liberty is to the foot passenger to walk in the middle of the road, then obviously the same liberty is also to the cab driver. So he can also drive his car on the pavement. If this happens, then there will be the condition of chaos. Everywhere there will be the chaos. This type of liberty would create a type of chaos. Everybody would be getting in everybody else way and nobody would get anywhere if this kind of passengers, foot passengers and car drivers are there. Then individual liberty as that old lady gives the answer that we have got liberty. She has her individual liberty but then individual liberty would have become social anarchy. This kind of individual liberty will become the social anarchy. When the policeman say at Piccadilly Circus steps into the middle of the road and puts out his hand, he is the symbol not of tyranny but of liberty. If policeman would interfere with no one, the result would be the Piccadilly Circus would be a maelstrom that you would never cross at all. You have submitted to a curtailment of private liberty in order that you may enjoy a social order which makes your liberty a reality. The Sapan Pailar ki ek vraddha matari rasta cha madhumad chalat hoti ani kunitari tya ajila sangitla ki tumhala chalna sakhi bazula putpat ahe pavement ahe tumhi tithun chala tewa ti asa mante ki mala swatantra ahe mala watel tithe mi chalen asa ti uddhat pane uttar dete pan jya rasta var chalna ra taxi driver ne zar asa matla ki mala pan फुटपाथ वरून चालव गाडी चालवण्याचं स्वातंत्र्य आहे असं जर त्याने म्हटलं तर मग तिथं काय होऊ शकतं याची आपण कल्पना करू शकतो एजी गार्डिनर हॅज गिव्हन अन एक्झाम्पल ऑफ दिस पोलिसमॅन द पोलिसमॅन इज नॉट द सिम्बल ऑफ टेरॅनी बट ऑफ लिबर्टी जो रस्त्यावर थांबलेला जो ट्रॅफिक पोलीस असतो तो कर्मचारी हा तो बेबंदशाहीचं प्रतीक नाहीये तर तो स्वातंत्र्याचं प्रतीक आहे असं एजी गार्डिनर म्हणतात इफ द पोलीस वुड इंटरफिअर विथ नो वन अँड द रिझल्ट वुड बी दॅट पिकॅडली सर्कस वुड बी अ मेल स्ट्रॉम दॅट यू नेव्हर क्रॉस 
at all you would never cross at all you have submitted to the curtailment of private liberty in order that you may enjoy a social order which makes your liberty a reality eji gardener asa sangtat ki dar ta traffic police ne jar apla kaam nahi kele kiwa ज्याने नियम तोडले त्यांना जर त्यांनी पनिशमेंट नाही दिली तर आणि सगळ्यांना जर त्याने नियम मोडायला जर मुभा दिली तर मग काय होईल ही कोणीही रस्त्यातून कुठं जाऊ शकणार नाही आणि रस्त्यामध्ये अशी परिस्थिती निर्माण होईल की कोणीही कुठल्याही दिशेनं चालत आहे जात आहे आणि गाड्या समोरासमोर येतील आणि मग कोणीही कुठं जाऊ शकणार नाही आणि तिथं एक प्रकारचा गोंधळ निर्माण होईल मग तो पोलीस आपल्याला जो अडवतो नियमाचं पालन करायला लावतो तर तो आपलं स्वातंत्र्य आपल्या स्वातंत्र्यावर तो गदा आणत नाही आहे हे आपल्याला स्वातंत्र्य आहे म्हणून आपण कुठल्याही दिशेनं नियमाचं उल्लंघन करून जाऊ शकत नाही दॅट वी हॅव टू सबमिट द कर्टलमेंट ऑफ प्रायव्हेट लिबर्टी फॉर द सोशल लिबर्टी की आपल्याला आपलं वैयक्तिक स्वातंत्र्य हे थोड्या काळासाठी किंवा काही काळासाठी किंवा चांगल्या गोष्टीसाठी थोडस त्या स्वातंत्र्यावर आपल्याला बंधन आणावी लागतात तरच ही सोशल ऑर्डर किंवा सामाजिक सुस्थिती राहू शकते किंवा सामाजिक स्वातंत्र्य हे अबाधित राहू शकत आणि ते जर अबाधित राहिलं तरच खऱ्या अर्थाने आपली वैयक्तिक लिबर्टी जी आहे किंवा स्वातंत्र्य आहे ते आपल्या खऱ्या अर्थाने आपल्याला मिळू शकत लिबर्टी इज नॉट अ पर्सनल अफेअर ओनली बट अ सोशल कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट आणि एजी गार्डिनर असं म्हणतात की हे एक सामाजिक कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट आहे सोशल कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट आहे हे कंत्राट आहे किंवा हे एक बंधन आहे सामाजिक बंधन आहे की पर्सनल अफेअर नाही आहे आपलं वैयक्तिक स्वातंत्र्य म्हणजे आपलं वैयक्तिक नाही आहे पण त्यासोबत त्या वैयक्तिक स्वातंत्र्यासोबत एक सामाजिक बंधन पण येतं जे आपल्याला पाळावं लागतं इन पर्सनल मॅटर्स लाईक चुजिंग अ ड्रेस स्टडिंग सब्जेक्ट किपिंग लॉंग हेअर एटसेट्रा वी नीड नॉट आस्क अनदर फॉर अनदर्स परमिशन देर इज अ बिग किंगडम ऑफ अवर ओन इन विच वी रूल अलोन अँड इन दिस किंगडम वी आर ॲज फ्री ॲज वी लाईक सो देर आर सम सम लिबर्टी टू एव्हरी वन what kind of liberty choosing a dress studying a subject keeping long hair okay asha kahi goshti madhe aplyala purna swatantra ahe kasha prakar chi hair style kasha prakar cha dress apan select karaycha kiwa kutla subject apan nivdaycha ba nivdaycha bsc nivdaycha ka bcom nivdaycha he aplyala swatantra ahe ani tyamadhe suddha kutle vishay nivdaycha aplyala swatantra ahe त्याच पद्धतीनं याच्यामध्ये आपण कुठल्याही कुणालाही आपल्याला याच्यामध्ये अडथळा आणण्याची काही आवश्यकता नाही आपल्याला इतर वी नीड नॉट टू आस्क अदर्स परमिशन इन दीज मॅटर्स दिस इज अ बिग किंगडम ऑफ आवर ओन हे आपलं एक स्वातंत्र्य आहे आणि ज्या आपलं एक अधिराज्य आहे आणि ज्याच्यामध्ये आपण ह्या सर्व गोष्टी निवडू शकतो विच वी रूल अलोन आणि या सर्व स्वातंत्र्याचा जो अधिराज्य गाजवणार आहोत कोणी व्यक्ती असेल तर रुलर कोण असेल तर तो आपण असतो या किंगडमचा जो राजा असतो तो आपण स्वतः असतो वी आर फ्री ऍज वी लाईक आपण ज्या पद्धतीनं आपल्याला वेशभूषा केशभूषा विषयाचं स्वातंत्र्य या सर्व गोष्टींमध्ये आपण मनाचे राजे असतो असं लेखक म्हणतात and you will not ask me whether you may follow this religion or that whether you follow protestant or catholic whether you may prefer ella willer wilcox to wordsworth or champagne to shandy gardiner says that you have the freedom to follow the religion you have freedom to follow the author to read the books according to your interest or you can consume champagne or shandy it is up to you this is the personal liberty ki lekhak asa sangto ki ekadala dharma swatantra ahe kutla lekhak ani kutla pustak tani vachaycha 
हे तो ठरवू शकतो कुठलं मध्य तो कन्झ्युम करू शकतो ते त्याचा वैयक्तिक प्रश्न आहे वी हॅव अ होल किंगडम इन विच वी रूल अलोन कॅन डू वॉट वी चूज बी वाईज और रिडिक्युलस हार्श और इझी कन्व्हेन्शनल और ऑड बट डायरेक्टली वी स्टेप आउट ऑफ द किंगडम और पर्सनल लिबर्टी ऑफ ऍक्शन बिकम्स क्वालिफाईड बाय अदर पीपल्स लिबर्टी आय माईट लाईक to practice on the trombone from midnight till 3 in the morning if i went on to the top of the everest to do it i could please myself but if i do it in my bedroom my family would object if i do it out in streets the neighbors will remind me that my liberty to blow the trombone must not interfere with their liberty to sleep in quiet so your personal liberty there is a kingdom of your personal liberty it may be ridiculous or wise it may be harsh or easy it may be conventional or odd tumcha vayaktik swatantra tumcha purta maryadit asel tar tu ek kasha hi paddhatiche asel tacha tumhala swatantra ahe पण त्या तुमच्या पर्सनल इंडिव्हिज्युअल लिबर्टीच्या बाहेर जेव्हा तुम्ही पडता तेव्हा जेव्हा हे तुमचं स्वातंत्र्य एखाद्या दुसऱ्या व्यक्तीच्या स्वातंत्र्याला बाधक ठरत असेल ऍट दॅट टाइम दॅट पर्सनल लिबर्टी ऑर इंडिव्हिज्युअल लिबर्टी हॅज टू बी कर्टेल गार्डिनर हॅज गिव्हन अन एक्झाम्पल ऑफ दॅट समबडी वॉन्ट्स टू लर्न अँड प्रॅक्टिस स्ट्रॉंग मोर it is an uh, it is a musical instrument and if somebody wants to practice this musical instrument he can practice anywhere but he should not disturb to others if he likes to practice this instrument at the everest if he likes he can but if he is practicing this trombone in his bedroom then his family members will object tala jar to trombone nawaza jo ek vadya ahe tala jar ekada vyakti la shikaycha asel to ekada everest var vajvat asel tar kunala hi tyacha disturb honar nahi pan to gharat bedroom madhe vajvat asel tar gharatlya itar mandalanna tyacha tyacha ek tras hou shakto tyas paddhatina he gives that example that if that person blows that trombone at the street then the liberty of the neighbors to sleep in quiet will be disturbed mag tani jar ekhada tez vadya madhyaratri pasun sakale 3 vajje paryant tala vajvaycha asel ani to rastyavar yeun sandhyakale ratri madhyaratri vajvat asel tar tyacha ya kratyamule neighbors kiwa tyacha shejaryancha je स्वातंत्र्य आहे शांतपणे झोपण्याच याच स्वातंत्र्य या लोकांचं स्वातंत्र्य अबाधित राहणार नाही म्हणून अशा काही लोकांचं त्यावेळेस ते असं म्हणू शकत नाहीत की मला माझं स्वातंत्र्य आहे आणि मी कुठंही केव्हाही कुठल्याही वेळी वाजवू शकतो असं म्हटलं तर चालत नाही ऍट दॅट टाइम हिज लिबर्टी हॅज टू बी कर्टन टू मेंटेन द सोशल ऑर्डर दिस इज द पॉइंट ए जी गार्डिनर वॉन्ट्स टू टेल यू इन दिस एस ए there are lot of people in the world and i have to accommodate my liberty to their liberty so we have to accommodate our liberty to their liberty baras baras aplo swatantra he tancha itarancha swatantra sathi ek aplyala vaparav lagto and when the author got into the railway carriage eg gardener gives his own example when he got into the railway carriage he was trying to read a blue book in a railway carriage but he could not read because the necessary quiet was not there as at the next station a couple of men entered in the carriage and one of them kept talking to his friend in a loud and pompous voice till the rest of the journey so when he was uh, traveling by the train in a railway carriage he was trying to read a blue book and there was not a quiet atmosphere and at the next station 
a couple of men entered into the carriage a crowd entered into the carriage and one of them who was talking very loudly to the other friends and he was talking with a pompous voice till the rest of the journey of ag gardener but the author did not ask them to talk in a lower tone because the man believed he believed that nobody could have anything better to do than to listen him and he says further says that uh, he was not tried to talk him about his loudness he never tried to tell him to stop talking and uh, he was being disturbed by his pompous talk loud voice because that man that man who was talking loudly was thinking that the only thing is that he is talking very you know in a very good manner and this is the only thing that people can listen to him other than to read something ane eka ek udharan te detat ki jevha te railway ne pravas karat hote ej gardener tevha tya railway cha dabya madhe ते एक ब्लू बुक जे व्यावसायिक व्यवसाय लगना जे पुस्तक आहे ब्लू बुक ज्यादा महति उपयोग होते स्टेशन लाही लोग आतला एक क्राउड मधला जो व्यक्ति है तो फार बोलत होता लेखक ब्लू बुक वाचू शक न व्यक्ति अरे बाबा थोड़ा हलू नहीं बोल मैं इकड़ वाचना चाहिए प्रयत्न करते जो व्यक्ति बोलत होता तो अशा आविर्भा मध्य होता कि डब्या मध्या लोकानी ऐका बोल इतर ऐकने सार्क है दुसर का हीच ऐकने सार्क नहीं कि दुसर का हीच कर सार्क नहीं फिर सगे ऐकुन घा आविर्भा मध्य तो बोलत होता अशा मूर्ख मनसाला बोलने मध्य अर्थ नोले दिस वॉज द एक्जाम्पल सो वॉट इज दिस एक्जाम्पल टेल्स एस दैट द पर्सन हू वॉज टॉकिंग लाउडली एंड वेरी पॉम्पसली ही वॉज इंटरफेरिंग विथ द अदर पीपल्स लिबर्टी दैट पर्सन ट्राइज टू रीड द बुक it is his liberty to read the book in the journey but that man was interfering that man was disturbing the social atmosphere in that train so this is the example that at that time such kind of a freedom such kind of a liberty has to be curtailed the person should have taken care not to disturb any passenger with his behavior so that person or other such persons has to take care that they would not disturb to any other passengers uh, with their behavior uh, so many passengers sometimes uh, they play the cards and even some passengers do so many wrong things in the train uh, so that other people may get disturbed so this kind of a liberty is not a good thing to maintain the social order as a gardener talks about about social conduct it is said that women are less civilized than the men a woman who is well dressed would thrust herself in front of a man in the queue at the ticket office she does this because men do not oppose her and men do not break the queue so it is said that women are less civilized and men are more civilized because one example is given that a woman who is in a very well dressed she thrusts herself she breaks the queue and she is trying to take the ticket before the other persons so this is an example that women are less civilized why this example has been given by ag gardener i don't know but this is the example in the essay this may be 
uh, true or not i don't know she does a, she does this because men don't oppose her and men don't break the queue it is supposed that she does this because other men will not oppose her because she is a woman and that other people will not break the queue a man is better trained in a social behavior it is supposed that man is better trained in social behavior ki mansala asha prakar cha shikavlela asta ki samajat kasha paddhatine vagaycha gardener thinks that the rights of small and quiet people are as important to preserve the rights of small nationalities and that the rights of a small and quiet people has to be preserved that liberty has to be preserved as we preserve the rights of a small nationalities ekada lahan deshacha rashtriyatva jase japla jata tashas prakar cha kya je samajamadhil so called लहान मानस असतात किंवा हे जे गरीब माणसं असतात शांत माणसं असतात त्यांचं स्वातंत्र्य हे अबाधित ठेवलं पाहिजे त्यांची हक्क जपली पाहिजेत असं एजी गार्डीन सांगतात इफ मोटारिस्ट डेलिव्हर डेलिव्हरेटली हॉर्न्स हिज व्हेकल कंटिन्युअसली टू बुली ऑदर्स इट इज लाईक द बुलोईंग ऑफ स्मॉल नेशन ऑफ बेल्जियम बाय अ बिग नेशन जर्मनी again example is given to uh, tell this thing that the liberty of quiet and a small people has to be maintained and for that he says that that a motorist if he deliberately horns his vehicle to bully others on the road it is like that bullying a small nation like belgium by big nation like germany ekhada jar motorcycle swar ha vinakaran samorcha vyaktila tras denasathi tacha gadi cha horn vajvat asel itaranna tras denasarkha jasa ekhada lahan deshala motha deshakadun tras dila jato jasa belgium sarkha lahan deshala germany sarkha motha deshakadun tras dila jato chin sarkha motha deshakadun भूतान सारख्या लहान देशाला किंवा फिलिपाईन्स सारख्या लहान देशाला त्रास दिला जातो तशा प्रकारचा हा प्रकार असू शकतो की गुंडगिरी करण्यासाठी मोटारिस्ट विनाकारण आपल्या गाडीचा हॉर्न वाजवत असेल सो इट इज नॉट हिज लिबर्टी टू बुली ऑदर पर्सन बाय ब्लोईंग हिज हॉर्न सो दिस थिंग हॅज टू बी कटेल्ड देर शुड बी सम काइंड ऑफ कंट्रोल ऑन दीज टाइप ऑफ पीपल आय जी गार्डनर सेज in this essay no one has right to bully other person or motorist on the road this is not civilized behavior so it it cannot be civilized behavior of any person who is bullying other person like that motorist on the road william hazlitt a great author said that if a person wants to learn the musical instrument like trombone but he should learn at his own home he should try to create a minimum disturbance he should close windows of his ho- his house similarly if someone would like to play the gramophone at the house that person should keep the volume low so as not to disturb neighbors it's like entering into their gardens without any invitation and trampling their flower beds so he gives another example as william hazlitt thinks that uh, if we want to learn some musical instrument like trombone then we have to close the windows of our home and then we have to practice it so that there will be the minimum disturbance to the neighbors कि आपल्याला एखादं वाद्य वाजवायचं असेल तर इतरांना आणि विशेषतः शेजाऱ्यांना त्रास होऊ नये म्हणून आपण दार आणि घराची दार खिडक्या बंद करून हे एखादं म्युझिक इन्स्ट्रुमेंट वाजवलं तर चालेल जेणेकरून इतरांना कमीत कमी त्रास होईल 
in the same way similarly if someone would like to play the gramophone at the house the person should keep the volume low so as not to disturb the neighbors त्याच पद्धतीनं एखाद्याला ग्रामोफोन किंवा टेप रेकॉर्डर किंवा सी डी प्लेअर किंवा एखादा म्युझिक प्लेअर त्याच्यावर गाणे ऐकायचे असतील तर त्याने एखाद्या कार्यक्रमात जो लाऊड स्पीकर लावला असतो तशा पद्धतीनं तो ते घरामध्ये गाणे लावू नयेत जेणेकरून ग्रामोफोन सारखा एखादा म्युझिकल इन्स्ट्रुमेंट आहे किंवा एखादा टेप रेकॉर्डर सारखा असेल किंवा एखादा सी डी प्लेअर किंवा म्युझिक प्लेअर असेल तो अशा पद्धतीनं आपण लावला पाहिजे की इतरांना त्याचा त्रास होणार नाही विशेषतः नेबर्सला इट इज लाईक एंटरिंग इन टू देअर गार्डन विदाउट एनी इन्व्हिटेशन अँड ट्रॅम्पलिंग देअर फ्लावर बॅट हे जर आपण असं एखादं वाद्य वाजवत असू आणि आपला घरातला आवाज गाण्याचा तिकडे जात असेल तर इट इज लाईक एंटरिंग इन टू देअर गार्डन हे त्यांच्या बागेमध्ये त्यांच्या परवानगीशिवाय आपण उतरणं आहे आणि प्रवेश करणं आणि त्या लोकांची त्या गार्डन मधली फुलं तुडवणं आहे यासारखं ते आहे सो वी शुड नॉट प्ले द ग्रामोफोन इन लाऊड वाईज सो दॅट नेबर्स वुड नॉट बी डिस्टर्ब सो वी हॅव टू टेक केअर ऑफ द नेबर्स वेन वी आर प्लेईंग द ग्रामोफोन ऍट अवर होम और वी आर प्लेईंग सम म्युझिकल म्युझिक प्लेअर ऍट होम वी शुड प्ले इन अ लो वाईज सो दॅट अदर especially neighbors would not be get disturbed we should not decide whose liberty is important the friend of author does not like street pianos and whenever he find piano players and whenever he finds them he orders them away but there is an old lady who loves to listen to the music played on the street by street piano players so this is one question whose liberty is important one person may like one thing but other person will not like that thing as the example of the street piano player the friend of ag gardener does not like street piano players whenever he finds street piano players on the street he orders them away but there is an old lady who loves to listen them the music played on the piano by the street piano players so whose liberty is important the author's friend who does not like street piano player but an old lady who loves to listen both have the liberty but whose liberty is important this is the question it is difficult to decide whose liberty is more important the world is complex there should be balance between individual liberty and social liberty mag he tharavna far kathin ahe ki kunach swatantrya mahatvacha ahe jo lekhaka cha mitra ahe tala street piano avadat nahi pan ek vriddha mahila ahe tila street piano aikayla avadta दोघांचे स्वातंत्र्य आहे पण कुणाचं स्वातंत्र्य महत्वाचं आहे हे ठरवणं सामाजिक परिस्थितीमध्ये हे फार कठीण आहे अँड बिकॉज दिस वर्ल्ड इज कॉम्प्लेक्स कुणाला काय आवडेल तर कुणाला काय आवडेल हे सांगता येत नाही अँड दॅट्स वाय देर शुड बी बॅलन्स बिटवीन इंडिव्हिज्युअल लिबर्टी अँड सोशल लिबर्टी आणि म्हणून समाजात मोठ्या प्रमाणात जे लोकांना आवडतं त्या गोष्टी घडतात आणि घडल्या पाहिजेत आपल्या एकट्याला आवडते किंवा आवडत नाही म्हणून वी शुड नॉट अपोज टू सोसायटी फॉर सम गुड थिंग अँड दॅट्स वाय दॅट देर इज देर शुड बी बॅलन्स बिटवीन इंडिव्हिज्युअल लिबर्टी अँड द सोशल लिबर्टी दॅट वी हॅव टू मेंटेन द सोशल ऑर्डर अँड सोशल लिबर्टी वी शुड नॉट थिंक ऑफ अवर ओन लिबर्टी इफ द सोशल ऑर्डर इज इम्पॉर्टंट देअर this essay is an example of social rules what we need to follow that always we have to follow the rules of the society that helps to maintain the social order we should first think upon the social order not upon the individual liberty and we have to follow social rules 
and we should not harm others by our social conduct our social conduct should be so soft that we should not harm other people and this on the rule of the road this essay is about social liberty we should give small amount of liberty in order to preserve collective liberty or social liberty an individual must take into account the rights and feelings of the people among which he is and shape his behavior likewise this may be called social conduct according to the author a reasonable consideration for the right and feelings of others is the foundation of social conduct so we have to give the importance to the behavior of the people feelings and the rights of the people and according to their rights and feelings we have to shape our behavior this may be the uh, base of the social conduct and that a reasonable con consideration for the rights and feelings of other is the foundation of social conduct we have to consider the feelings of other people then only uh, we can have a good opinion about uh, the people and people will have good opinion about us so this is the foundation of social conduct that there is the uh, type of interdependency upon each other according to the gardener we can be neither complete anarchist nor complete socialist because the world in which we live is complex so one should be judicious mixture of both because we have back to preserve our individual liberty at the same time social liberty so that we cannot be anarchist or we cannot be complete socialist apan bebandh shahi paddhati nahi vagu shakat nahi ani samajik paddhati nahi vagu shakat nahi pan tacha madhe kutla tari yacha doghancha combination asla pahije there should be the judicious mixture of both and because we have back to preserve our individual liberty no doubt we have to preserve our individual liberty but that liberty should not hurt to other people it should not be the hurdle in maintaining the social liberty for that we have to work for social liberty is important and we have to follow the rules on the road we have to think to maintain the social order social liberty collective liberty this is the essence of this essay on the rule of the road by ag gardiner so in this video we have seen that more than individual liberty social liberty is important and we have to give the importance to the social liberty to maintain the social order because we have to respect the liberty of other people while maintaining our own liberty sometimes we have to give the importance to the other people's liberty social liberty to maintain the social order so thank you for being with me in this video lecture if you like this video you can hit the like button you can share this video with your friends and do not forget to subscribe my youtube video channel you can find some more educational videos on this video channel you can go and watch k gutte's online lecture series whole lecture series you can get on this youtube channel thank you again for watching this video have a nice day